A Dayton woman is dead after a crash involving three semis up on Interstate 75. We first brought you this story as breaking news on First at Four. Tonight, two news reporter Judith Ratana talked with a Sydney teenager who helped some of those crash victims. She shares this interview new at 10. Ohio State Highway Patrol is identifying 60 year old Deborah Hurst as a victim in this Sydney area crash. And while all this chaos is happening, a local 17 year old says he was just trying to do the right thing. Traffic on Interstate 75 north of Sydney came to a standstill Thursday afternoon. Ohio State Highway Patrol says a semi traveling north failed to slow down, hitting several vehicles. 17 year old Harley Campbell says he was there the moment it happened. I seen a little bit of soybean go up into the air and seen a little bit of smoke. And as I look over, there was a few vehicles getting launched off the side of the interstate. State police say two semis and a pickup collided and went into the median. Campbell didn't hesitate to help. It was just one of those things that seemed like somebody needed my help, so decided to pull over and do what I could. In total, three semis and three passenger vehicles were involved in the crash. Campbell says he saw people trapped in their cars and at least one person bleeding heavily. Ran around and I started looking for people stuck in their vehicles and I went to the one that nobody climbed out of and I started checking and tried to peel the door open on it. The Sydney team was able to get away from the vehicles before they exploded. He isn't surprised to hear police suspect speed was a factor. No, not at all. It, going too fast and not paying attention and it's two things you can't do. Campbell doesn't consider himself a hero. He says he was just doing the right thing. Aside from the one fatality, one person was taken to the hospital with injuries. State police say charges are pending while they continue to investigate this crash. In Shelby County, Judith Havana, 2 News, working for you.